Hi there. Um, just a quick video I wanted to put together today. I was going to introduce you to one of our final year students. Um, I'm Craig Lashford, the course director for physical geography at Coventry University, and I'll pass over to Charlotte. Let her introduce herself. Hi, my name's Charlotte, and I'm a final year student at Coventry University. So we're just going to have a bit of a chat about really what you did, Charlotte, last year. So you you were on placement last year, so you've come back into to your final year. It's something that we offer um, to all our students at Coventry uh, that do geography. And a, a good few will take it up every year. So what did you actually do on your placement? Um, so I went to a company called JBA Consulting, where I worked as a technician for a year. I work along, uh, alongside other colleagues on GIS projects, hydraulic modelling and looking into um, flood risk. I mean, you did quite a bit. I mean, it's, as you know, it's something I want particularly. <laughs> so with the flood modelling stuff, how have you, because obviously that's quite a, a very specific skill. Did you... Yeah. Yeah. Did you have any of that beforehand? Did you? Um, I had no clue how to hydraulic model at all. Um, I had to be I had to be taught from scratch. But it's a hard. It was a hard process at first. But the more I learned, it allowed me to do stuff in my degree that I wouldn't have been able to do before. Well, and and I think that's the the kind of beauty of doing the placement, really, to give you those opportunities. And particularly, so I mean, I think it's I think you deserve a lot of credit in the sense you threw yourself completely out of your comfort zone. I mean, you did GIS, didn't you, at second year? Yeah, I did GIS, but I didn't do anything with hydraulic modelling. <laughs> <laughs> I've started to bring you in bits of some of my modules now, but not to that, because you used, you used Flood Modeler, didn't you? And Two Flow. And Two Flow, cool. So where were you, where was it based in? Were you, were you which, J, where were you based with, with JBA? Um, I was based in the Coles Hill office, so Warwickshire away. So not too far, really, from the Midlands at all. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's always handy as well. We've got, because we, I think I am right in saying, aren't I? We, 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 take, we, we send a few students every year. Or, well, we've had the link with JBA for a few years, haven't we? Uh, yeah, so I think there's been about three, place, three or four placement students now. Um, and there's quite a few ex Coventry University students in that office as well. Yeah, I, I, I know that I can think of a few of ones I've taught over the last few years. So how did you go about getting the placement? Because um, I know it's something we offer as a we offer a four year degree at Coventry. So every student is enrolled on this idea of taking that, that that end of their second year to do a placement. You don't have to do it if people don't want to. But how did you go about getting it? Uh, so for me, I looked quite a lot through um, is it the talent portal, kind of looking at job adverts and seeing what came about and the JBA uh, placement got emailed around um, as a second year through email so I just decided to fly through there um, and I just had to send in my CV to the talent team and it got sent off through that. Oh fantastic yeah so the talent team at the university they kind of support placement stuff don't they and then they also help kind of in your final year with with future stuff as well so has how have you used your placement in your final year have you has it been I'm assuming it's been of use yeah, it's been very beneficial. So I've decided to structure my dissertation around hydraulic modelling and looking how we can implement natural flood management into these hydraulic models. So all the skills I have learned on placement have helped to build this model of a water course. But also I've been able to use GIS to map stuff and locate things, which has been really useful. I, uh, we've already spoken about it before. We could talk for quite some time about the project <laughs> itself. Because it's <laughs> both of us, I know, are particularly interested in. Has it? As, as well as your dissertations it helped in other modules as well so you, you did GIS at third year didn't you as well yeah it's really helped with GIS third year because I've gone into I can go and use ArcGIS with a click of a button I don't really need to think about it um I found it really helped in my coursework as well because I was doing a lot of processing in GIS um and I was looking into the difference in uh LIDAR and how we can see erosion and deposition on riverbanks and stuff from it so all of that kind of helped to produce this overall project where I had loads of nice maps and stuff, which was great. <laughs> <laughs> Always good. But I suppose it's also the confidence as well, isn't it? It gives you that, that confidence to actually know that, because you did, like, as we said a minute ago, you did GIS at second year, but it's that knowing that actually you can do that and you, you know, you can then achieve and understand what you want to do with basically on your own a little bit. And it gives you that confidence. That's certainly my experience of working with placement students previously. Yeah, I feel a lot more confident in myself. I feel like I know more about what I'm on about instead of just trying to talk to someone who knows loads of information and I'm a student. Uh, I feel like it really helped me grow in the sense of now I know exactly also what I want to kind of do once I leave. I know that I want to work in flood risk industry. So I think it was really beneficial in that point. Yeah, and I, and I, I know, so I, I don't know how many of your friends, when I, it probably would have been about, I normally say it's about 30-ish percent so 
a, a, a 30 to 40 percent or so go out on placement or, or whatnot and I, I think certainly from my experience of teaching I think the students that come back from placement tend to have that extra level of, of maybe dedication but also that extra level of knowledge I think is, is which is really helpful from just being in a workplace for a year um, and then applying that to their their life as, as final year students so you mentioned briefly so you, that's what you think you, your placement has really kind of made you think about what you want to do then when you finish make going that going to the flood industry has it yeah <laughs> I just I think it's really interesting and I feel especially with like it, it's a very key topic because we've got a lot of stuff being coming out about climate change a lot about uh, what the EA wants to push forward and stuff like that and I feel it's an industry that's going to keep growing it's never going to end because there's always going to be a, a natural hazard in the UK with it so <laughs> exactly and and you, sorry I'm going to just you mentioned the EA the Environment Agency you also did a short summer placement with them didn't you uh, yes in the summer of 2018 um, I was working as part of the planning and strategic overview team um, and I got to go and look around kind of the schemes that the EA have been working on. I got to go out with a hydrologist for the day and stuff like that. And it's just really good fun <laughs> just to yeah. see what the different aspects are. And, and I think the, that that's something that's a really useful kind of it was a summer placement scheme. I know we had, had had people working for the Environment Agency previously. We've got quite a lot of our graduates actually at the Environment. You worked with one of them, didn't you? I seem to remember. Gabby. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Um, well, thank, so I suppose the last thing, how did you have so you just to confirm you definitely found the placement a useful and enjoyable experience yeah I did yes <laughs> <laughs> perfect and you've enjoyed your time at Coventry you're coming to the end now of, of your four yeah. years which is slightly I really enjoyed being at Cov well Coventry University um but yeah I I will miss it actually I I will I'll say that for you I'll miss it <laughs> well that's good to hear thank you very much Charlotte I really appreciate that okay.